guys welcome back to my channel so today I got a easy quick simple recipe for you guys so today we're going to cook McCormick's five ingredient French toast spread when I say amazing and good but on top of that when I say so quick easy and simple like you cannot go wrong with this recipe okay so anyways with no further ado let's jump right into this video with this easy and simple recipe, you literally, literally need one egg, McCormick ground cinnamon, McCormick's pure vanilla, one fourth cup of milk, and four slices of bread. Whether you use Texas toast, regular bread, wheat bread, French toast, whatever kind of bread you want, as long as you got four slices. So you want a nice size bowl so you can dip your bread in um, front to back. I'm going to crack this egg open. And I just like to remove this white part sometimes. In this case, I do. That. And one small one here. There we go. And you want your pure vanilla there we go and you want a teaspoon of pure vanilla one teaspoon of pure vanilla and you want a half a teaspoon of ground cinnamon You're gonna take your whisk and you want to whisk this together. When I say this smell good, this smell good, y'all. Smell like cinnamon rolls. Okay, now you want to add in your one fourth cup of milk. Look at that goodness. All right. So I have my skillet here, my cast iron skillet. And I want it on medium heat. But you want to lightly grease the pan, so I'll just have some butter here. I'm just gonna grease my pan with. You can use cooking spray if you like. You can use a skillet. You can use Whatever you have flat or you able to um, lay the bread on. So I'm just gonna let that heat up. Now that our pan has warmed up, you wanna take your egg mixture, just stir it up because the cinnamon is at the bottom. You wanna take your bread and you just wanna Soak it up with that goodness. Like that. And you want to drop it on here. Turn my eye on four. 
and you want it to cook until it turns brown. Now, if you want to make more of these, this recipe only makes four. If you want to make more, you double the recipe and it can give you a little bit more. So that's all I can get on my skillet. I'm gonna let my last little bread soak up this goodness. And I'm gonna get these a uh, few seconds to cook before flipping them. Oh yeah. I probably should have put two on there because I don't want them to tear. Oh, that's gonna cook beautiful. So just give them a few minutes on each side, cook until they are golden brown. Our French toast is complete. They are done. You can turn your eye off. If you have a cast iron like this, be careful because it is hot. So make sure you remove it with the um, with the pot holder. Our French toasts are done. You take you some butter and slap it on top of it like that. And drizzle, use some syrup over top of it. And you can top with confetti sugar. You can top with any kind of fresh fruits you want. Strawberries, bananas, blueberries, raspberries, whatever at this point. Quick, simple, easy. Five ingredients. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And you guys stay tuned to the next video. I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.